Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be sharing something a little bit different with you. I'm going to be sharing a haul, but not a makeup haul. Not a makeup haul. I wanted to share some things I found recently at Target and Old Navy. It's mostly clothes, but it's just a little bit of everything, and I thought it would be fun to share. Pretty much all of these things are new, so you should be able to find them in store or online. So I figured I would share them with you. If you're new here, my name is Blair. I typically focus on makeup and beauty here on my channel, but I do sprinkle a little bit of lifestyle in every now and then. I hope you'll stick around and subscribe to my channel. And let's go ahead and get into it. I have lots of goodies from Target and some more from Old Navy as well. So let's get into it. I am going to try these things on for you and I'll just overlay the clips of me trying them on as I'm talking. So I hope you enjoy. I will list and link everything below and let's get started. Let's get started with Target. So I, I am a huge Target shopper. In fact, uh, a lot of the things in my house home decor wise, I'm kind of working on my house and furnishing it and everything that I'm going to talk about in another video, but I have found so many good fall home decor pieces at Target this year. They are really knocking it out of the park in really all categories, but this is not about home decor. This is just some random things. So I'll start with, okay, confession, I already wore these because I just couldn't wait until I filmed <laughs> this haul. But I got a new pair of pajamas. Now you're probably not gonna be able to see these very well. I don't know if I'm gonna try on the pajamas, but this is the top, it's long sleeve, and the bottoms are shorts that look like this, but they're really soft material. They're like a modal material, if you're familiar with that. It's very, silky and it just feels really good to sleep in. It's really cool as well if you get hot at night. And I typically like shorts unless it's really, really cold, which right now in North Carolina, it's not. So I like shorts. My arms can sometimes get cold, so that's why I went with one that was long sleeved. But these are so comfortable, you guys. The brand is Stars Above. And that's like their main sleepwear line, the Target sleepwear line. You're probably familiar with it. I've tried a few things from them, but these are by far my favorite. Like I said, I've already worn them and I love them. So if you are in need of a good pair of pajamas, I am a big pajama person. When I was a little girl, I was very much into pajamas. I didn't care as much about clothes or anything like that when I would go to Limited 2, if you're familiar with that. It's now called Justice. Is Justice even around anymore? I don't know. But when I would go there when I was little, I would go straight to the pajamas. I've always been a pajamas girl. I don't know just something about it. I love all things cozy, including pajamas. So I did get those from Target. I wear a size medium. If you are curious, I'm kind of in between a small and a medium. I'm typically, I would say like a size 27 or a size four, sometimes a size two. It just kind of depends on what it is. For pajamas, I typically like to go up in size and not down because I don't like things to be tight and restricting when I'm sleeping. So I did get a medium in those. If you were curious, now, I have two skincare items. One of these I had heard about before, and one of them I had not. The first one is by the brand Naturium, and it's the multi-peptide moisturizer. So this brand is a fairly new brand to Target, I'm pretty sure. The founder of this brand, I don't know her name. I will put it up on the screen. I know she has a YouTube channel. She does TikTok and Instagram content too. But that is actually not where I heard about this product. One of my favorite creators here on YouTube, Alexa Chan, was talking about how she loved this moisturizer. And I typically like the same kinds of things that she does. 
and Naturium happened to be 20% off at Target when I was there, so I took that as a sign that I needed to try this. It says it's a nutrient-dense moisturizer formulated with peptide blends and cap encapsulated ethylated vitamin C and panthenol to target the look of fine lines and wrinkles for a more youthful looking complexion. So I'm really excited to try this. I don't know a ton about this brand, but what I have heard has been pretty positive. So I did get that to try out. And then this is probably the one I'm the most excited about. I had not heard of this, so this has to be a new product, but it is by Vanna Cream. And it's the facial moisturizer, but it's with SPF. I have talked about the Vanna Cream Daily Facial Moisturizer in a few videos before. It's just a really good everyday moisturizer, no fragrance or anything weird that will irritate your skin, and it's great under makeup. I'll put a picture up on the screen. So I think this is the same thing, but it has sunscreen. It's 19.5% zinc oxide so it's SPF 30 so I haven't tried it yet but I am super excited I also have been using the Vanna cream cleanser and I really like that too so this is what the tube looks like if you have sensitive skin definitely look into Vanna cream I was gonna open this up and see I read the reviews before I bought it and a lot of them said even though this is an all zinc sunscreen, that it does not have a bad white cast. So we will see, because if you wear mineral sunscreens, then you know a lot of the time they have a really bad white cast, which is not typically what you're looking for under makeup. So that is it blended in, and yeah, it doesn't look to be a white cast at all. Also, it doesn't have a strong fragrance. So I will keep you updated and let you know when I try this, but I'm really excited about that. Okay, next I have a few clothing pieces from Target. I feel like Target clothes are either hit or miss for me. Sometimes I go in and I see tons of things that I really like, and then other times I go in and I don't see anything that I like that much. I feel like in the fall, though, I definitely fall <laughs> I definitely fall for new clothes. I am definitely a fall, colder weather kind of person. I just like, I love fall clothes. I love the fall season. It's my favorite. So the first thing is this little, I guess you would call this a Henley shirt, but it is, looks like this. It buttons up the front and it's kind of cropped. It's kind of like a thicker, t-shirt material. This is the kind of thing that I like. I am not super, I'm pretty minimal with my wardrobe. I don't really, I don't wear really out there kind of outfits. I wear very basic jeans, t-shirts, sweaters, a jacket every now and then. That's just kind of my style. I've always been kind of, or I haven't always been, but in the last few years I've gotten very minimal with my clothes. And I just like to wear my gold jewelry and a cute purse, do my makeup. That's just kind of my style. But this is super, super cute. I think this would be so cute just with jeans or whatever you want to wear it with. But this is definitely the type of top that I would wear for a video or on a daily basis. Super soft and comfortable. It's not too, too thick, so you won't get super hot in it. So I did get that. And then I also got this. Okay, I love a good flannel shirt. And Target has really cute ones this year. In fact, there are, I like almost all of them that they came out with. But I ended up getting this cream with brown, kind of like a warm orangey brown stripes on it. And this is actually a really nice quality flannel. I feel like sometimes flannel shirts can be kind of hit or miss. Sometimes they're flannel but they're that really thin kind of feels cheap kind of flannel. This one does not. Super cute. Again this is just my kind of shirt. I love to wear these over something like open or I love to button them up and just wear them on its own which is what I plan to do with this one. 
Typically, if I'm going to wear it open, kind of really oversized, I'll buy a larger size. I got a medium in this, so I could just button it up and wear it. But I just loved the colors. These are my tones, cream and brown, the warm fall tones. I love it. And then, okay, this might be the one I'm most excited about. <laughs> when you see it, if you know me, you know I love neutrals. That's my thing. I also love cozy things like I was talking about earlier and I found this sweater. So this was by A New Day which is one of Target's clothing brands but this has my four favorite colors to wear in it. It has tan, black, cream, and gray. It's like a, what would you call this, like a block, color block I think is what these are called. But it's just a really basic sweater. It's kind of cropped but not super super cropped. It doesn't have a weird sleeve which I also love. I know the kind of balloon sleeves are a big thing right now. The really poofy sleeves. I'm not a big fan of that. I like just a normal sleeve personally and I was happy to see that this one was just plain. I got a medium in this as well but I just love stuff like this. I thought this would be really cute for a video Sometimes I feel like I wear the same things in my videos and the reason for that is I don't buy clothes that often so I really re-wear the same things over and over. Let's be honest, I spend most of my money on makeup but every now and then the clothes get me and usually it's the fall season. Okay, this is the last thing from Target and it's a pair of shoes. You guys, when I tell you these were love at first sight, these were love at first sight and they're comfortable. So they're by Universal Threads and they're a pair of boots. So these are called the Fawn Boots with Memory Foam. So I've had multiple Target shoes in the past. A lot of the times their shoes are very cute. I very often see shoes that I like but their shoes are not always the most comfortable. These, you guys, are so comfortable and they're so stinking cute. Look at these boots. They have a little bit of a platform which makes them really comfortable and the top lining is like this faux fur. They're a really pretty, kind of a medium toned brown. But the best part is the memory foam in the sole so they do not hurt your feet. I knew as soon as I put this on my foot these were coming home with me <laughs> and the shoes were 30% off at the time at Target so that was enough for me but these are so cute. I don't know if they come in other colors. This was the only color that I saw but I cannot wait to wear these. I am definitely a boots girl. I don't have as many as I used to when I was younger, I definitely had more, much more clothing than I have now. I've kind of, or I've dialed it down quite a bit. But I love a good boot, and I'm so excited to wear these this fall. All right, let's move on to Old Navy. This is, I wasn't going to include this in the haul, but I figure <laughs> I would just tell you. So, yes, this is the infamous Stanley Cup. This past weekend was my birthday. And me and my mom were out shopping quite a bit. And we were talking about Stanley Cups. I was telling her how I really wanted a Stanley Cup. But they are nearly impossible to get your hands on right now. They have just blown up like crazy on TikTok. And now they're very difficult to get your hands on. So we were out and randomly went into a Dick's Sporting Goods. If you're familiar with Dick's, you know what I mean. It's kind of like an academy sports, that type of store. And um, we went in because I saw somebody post on Instagram or TikTok that they had been into a Dick's and saw some Stanley Cups. Now, I've only seen one or two people say this, but anyway, I was like, we'll just go in and see if they have anything. So we go in, we do a lap around the store no Stanley Cups. We're leaving and we pass this little, it's kind of an end cap like over near where the registers were and there 
sitting there on the end cap were two Stanley Cups. A purple one, which is the one I got, and a pink one. And I just couldn't believe it. I cannot believe they had the Stanley Cup. If you are on social media right now, you know the deal with the Stanley Cup. I don't know why, but I really wanted one of these. So I, of course, grabbed one immediately. I grabbed the lavender one. The pink one was cute too. So we kind of walk away like over to the register and not 10 or 15 seconds after that, two girls come in the, in the entrance, see the pink one and grab it immediately. I mean, these were gone in all of about 20 seconds. I don't know how I got lucky and got this, but I did, but it gets better. When I went to buy it, I had a $10 reward also. So I also got it $10 off. So anyway, that is my Stanley Cup story. And today's my first day using it actually. And I'm really enjoying it. I mean, I didn't really need another cup. I love a good cup though. And I love this lavender color. So let's move on to Old Navy. Old Navy is kind of similar to Target. I feel like they're kind of hit or miss. They either have a ton of cute stuff or I don't really like any of it. Right now they have really cute fall stuff. So first, like I said earlier, I am a big cozy person. I love coffee mugs, sweatpants, pajamas, literally anything cozy is my favorite thing. So you, if you've been watching my videos for a little while, you might have seen me mention a pair of shorts from Old Navy and they are lounge shorts. I don't even know the exact name, but I will list it below. Well, I went in this Old Navy and they had a new color. <laughs> oh, okay. These are the extra high rise vintage shorts, five inch inseam. So this is what they look like. They are super high rise. They have a pocket on the back and these 99% of the time when I film videos, you can see me from here up. I have on these shorts. <laughs> no matter what I'm wearing, it's just the most comfortable thing to sit and film in. I'm not about to sit and film in a pair of jeans. It's not gonna happen. So I need as many of these as I can get because I film so regularly. And they had this green color, which I love, especially for fall. I wear a size medium in those. And they also had the matching sweatshirt. So I had to get it, I had to get it. I got a size medium and this is just a plain crew neck sweatshirt, but this is the kind of stuff that excites me. I, it doesn't take a lot clothing wise to get me excited. I love simple, cozy things. That's what this was for me. So I got that. If you like to lounge around your house in shorts and you like high waisted things, look into these. They are so comfortable. They fit me perfectly. I also did get these and I think these are the same uh, pants but or the same style but in the jogger. So these are just gray jogger pants. They're just plain but again in the winter and the fall when I film or even when I'm not filming and I'm just staying home this is the kind of thing that I wear and I already know that I like the high waist version of these. So I did get a pair of these also in medium and all pretty much everything I bought was also on some kind of sale from Old Navy. It kind of depends when you shop, but most of this stuff was also on sale. Okay. And then I also got this. So again, a very basic piece, but it is this really cute cardigan in this oatmeal color. So it looks like this, it has two pockets on the front. And again, can you tell that I'm a neutrals kind of girl? These are my tones, these oatmeal, cream, brown, a little bit of green. I like the same things in clothes that I like in makeup, neutrals. So this super cute. And what I really liked about this is this feels like really good quality. You know how sometimes in Target, Old Navy, Walmart, wherever, 
you can kind of tell when you feel something if it's kind of cheaply made or if it's a better quality this one feels like very good quality and it does not have acrylic in it which I love because acrylic can sometimes pill which really annoys me in clothes but this one has no acrylic in it so I feel like this is just a really good staple piece to have in your closet and I think I got a small in this one yeah small it's going to be very clear to you what my style is when this video is over okay the next few things okay I got these jeans and it was the kind of situation where if you've ever experienced this let me know sometimes not often because jeans are tricky but sometimes you see a pair of jeans and they just look like they would fit you you just look at them and you think those look like something I would like that would fit me that's what happened with these jeans they are just plain black high-rise straight leg jeans they have no distressing or anything no holes the ends are not frayed they're just regular black jeans in a straight style which I love and the best part is these were on clearance for $11.99 yes $11.99 and they fit me like a Love. I don't know what it was, but I saw these on the sale rack and I just knew that these would fit me. I don't know how, I just knew that they would and they did. They are so stinking cute. They are, if you're interested in the fabric content, they are 99% cotton, 1% spandex. I like jeans with at least a little bit of spandex in them. I'm just not a 100% cotton jeans wear these are so cute you guys i think they were called the oh here it is sky high straight extra high rise jean and i wear a size four in these 11.99 that was probably my best deal of this whole haul i then also got this t-shirt if you know me at all this will not shock you look at this t-shirt coffee weather how cute like i said i love minimal easy t-shirts that's what i live in this is gray and black my favorite color and coffee weather i mean come on y'all know me i am a big big coffee drinker and this was let's see i think this was ten dollars yeah ten dollars it might have been on sale for eight somewhere around there but i got that i got a medium in that i don't like my stuff to run small so a lot of things i could probably wear a small in but I usually get a medium. And then, okay, another flannel. I told you guys you're gonna know my style by the end of this video. Cozy, comfortable, minimal. So it's a flannel from Old Navy, and again, with the colors. Neutral, gray, cream, black, I love it. This one I got in a large, because this one I want to wear open over something. I love that look with jeans, leggings, and like a tank underneath or a t-shirt underneath. Graphic t-shirts look really cute underneath, things like this. I just love it. So I did get this in a size large and I think this is, yeah, this is the boyfriend flannel shirt from Old Navy. And okay, so I showed you the black jeans. Well, those fit me so well that I wanted another pair if I could find them in the same style and I did so these are again the sky high straight jean seeker smooth pockets in a size 4 now these ones have a little bit of distressing on them and these are cut off on the bottom also these are button fly and the black ones were just a normal zipper these fit me like a glove, you guys. And these, this day, jeans were 50% off, regular price jeans. So these were, I think I paid like $21 for these. And they fit me perfectly. And they're from Old Navy. Old Navy. I had showed a few pair of jeans in my last vlog that I did. 
where I showed some Abercrombie jeans and I ended up returning most of those. I kept one of them, but I returned the rest of them. I don't know. I couldn't make up my mind. I just decided to keep one. So I did, but then I'm so happy I did because I ended up finding these and they were quite a bit less expensive. Oh, hold on. I wasn't going to include this in this video, but I have it sitting here. So I figured I'll show you this too. Um, I got a few things from Walmart. This is makeup stuff. So I got this because of Kelly Gooch. This is the Lottie London Super Fake False Lash Effect Mascara. I saw her talking about how this was one of her new favorites. It was just out of this world. It's like $7 and... I was in a Walmart. I randomly saw one of these. It looked like maybe someone, I don't know, it was the only one, kind of like it was an online return or something. I don't know. But I got it. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm really excited to try this. I've never tried anything from Lottie London before. I got this because of Jessica Braun. I cannot believe I've never tried this, but I haven't. And it's L'Oreal True Match Lumi Bronzer. I heard Jessica Braun in, I've heard her say it in several videos that she has been through a whole one of these and rebought it. This is a really large bronzer, so that's saying a lot. And it's a glowy bronzer, which is right up my alley. I got the shade Light and very excited to try that and this is the elf flawless brightening concealer now i have tried this before i didn't love the color that i had i ended up getting rid of it i got a new color this is the shade 28w I got this because of Shelby Wilson. She is just always raving about how this is such a good drugstore concealer. It's $6 and a really good dupe apparently for the YSL Touche Clot Pen Highlighter Concealer. I'm not sure what it's called exactly. I've never tried that, but I wanted to try this again. I don't remember a whole lot about it. I don't think I loved it before, but I also remember not loving the shade that I had. So. I got this to try again. All right, you guys, that is gonna be it for this haul. I hope you enjoyed this. If you like this type of content from me, make sure to let me know and I will continue to do them. I love a good Target haul. I love Old Navy too. I, I'm a huge Target person though. I go to Target quite frequently. We, we buy so many things there. Home stuff, like I said, That'll be coming in another video, and there's just a lot of really cute fall stuff right now. So I hope you enjoyed. If you liked it, make sure to subscribe for more videos from me. Like I said, I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And also make sure to follow me over on Instagram at simply.blair and TikTok simply.blair1. I will list and link everything below for you, and I will see you next time. Remember, simply be you. Bye.